Volunteers from the Butte Diaper Bank pass out hundreds of diapers here each month, but recently have been forced to turn away some families. Nicolette Barbita is a volunteer. She says they had to tell 29 families Saturday that they didn't have any diapers left in their child's size. When they receive the messaging from us that we don't have their size, it decreases their confidence and the their ability to be able to utilize our services, which means we may not see them again. One mother picking up diapers Saturday morning said even $30 a month can make a big difference. For example, if they came here and see the diapers available, maybe they will save $30. Then this is their $30, then they can use it for go shopping for vegetable, food for the baby. So it's really important to to have this $30, for example, to use it for another thing that the family needed. Yasmin says formula costs have risen as options have gotten smaller. She said it could be hard to predict how much formula babies will go through, and diaper donations have been a huge help in the meantime. Let's say, for example, but they took only four. The rest, you cannot use it. So what that mean? That meaning you need to spend more money for something you are not sure if the baby he will take it or not, and it's really expensive. The Butte Diaper Bank passes out hundreds of diapers each month. Nicolette said helping these families is especially important to her. Nobody should have to make a choice between being able to diaper their child or feed them. And that is, that's what fuels me. I, I, since there are no social safety net programs that cover diapers for families, it, you know, it's programs like ours that are able to do that. The nonprofit is entirely volunteer run, making donations especially important for distribution events to continue. In Chico, Chloe Curtis, Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. Thank you, Chloe. Employees from Butte Diaper Bank say what they need the most are diapers in sizes 5 and 6, as well as 4T and 5T pull-ups.